<laughs> and that's the job that God has given me because if he gave it to somebody who was always clever, you'd say, well, sir, look at that fellow. I knew, I'm sure. He got seven honors in his leaving, sir. I didn't even get the honor of doing it. <laughs> <laughs> I was expensed. <laughs> Can you imagine marrying a fellow like me? You better start praying because there's still more around. <laughs> And then the greatest word that God ever gave me. Glory to God who shows his power in me. And I can do much more, come on Jane, finish it, than I could ever ask, ever ask or, even or even imagine. And I see, I see footballers and the score of gold. Do you ever see them? Especially the South American guys that have a bit of religion. Come on in. The spuds are on. <laughs> are you expecting us? <laughs> Where's Jack? Did you ever see the South American footballers and they're going and they score a goal and they look at it and they tear out the feet and they stop? And to do that, they're saying, glory to God who showed his power in me. Because they say, I, I am the most expensive footballer in the world, but I don't know how that finished up in the net. And they run out and they say, Jesus, that one belongs to you, because I'm not that good. We're going to speak it. Who's afraid of the Bible here? No, do you mean I'm the only one? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I was told that was you. I was Joanna, I, I, is there only three people here? There's four. The man with the glasses, because this guy knows my problem. Come up here to me. Come on, come on. I want to give a clap to this guy. <laughs> This, I have a thing here called a starter pack because there's no point in most Catholics buying a Bible and trying to read it. Does anybody here that never read the Bible not understand this word? Did you all understand whatever the name? How are you doing? Hello, Jim. How are you? You're very welcome to town. What's your name? Nick. Nick. Come on, Nick. Nick. So come around, don't, I won't bite you. I <laughs> so I want you to hold that up because there's only two positions. You're either a slave to fear and you read it like that, or you're a child of God and you hold it up like that, Nick. Go, Nick. So I want you to put your name in there, but I want I want God to hear it so that He'll explode it. Far in Christ. I Nick. No, speak from the beginning. Okay. For in Christ, I, Nick, obtained freedom sealed by his blood. Now, do you want to tell us what you want to be free from? And don't say me. <laughs> freedom from fear. Okay. okay. Shout it. Freedom from fear. At the beginning. Firing. No, but you're not doing it loud enough. God okay. just needs to hear it. For in Christ's name, I, Nick, obtained freedom from fear. Sealed by his precious blood. Amen. 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 Come on, there's two more. Okay. Down. <laughs> <laughs> there's another 7,000. It's a good you start. Know, I'll tell you one thing. So hold it up again, but okay. you're not loud enough. And you see the word all. Oh. I want the painting to come off that wall when you say oh. He's got a loud voice, Jim. Yeah, get yeah, that. Well, then, you do it, then you can sing too if you want. Amen. So, <clears throat> I, Nick, can do all things through Jesus Christ who strengthens me. I didn't hear that word. Oh, oh. oh. yeah, loud. Uh, I didn't hear it. That yeah, was really quiet. Okay. I, I, Nick, yeah. can do. All things through Jesus Christ who strengthens me. Did you hear him? Amen. 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 <laughs> Woo! And this one, we're holding up. Now we can turn up. Power 
in me, Nick, and I can do much more than I could ever ask or even imagine. <laughs> Jokes. <laughs> you know, I can hear you when you whisper. I can hear you when you whisper too. Brilliant. But there's only two places going in the kingdom of God. It's not like a business where you have accountants and secretaries and salesmen and warehouse people and if you're not good at this job, they'll, they'll let you down the line and if you're very good, they'll promote you. There's no such thing, there's two places. You're a slave to the fear where I could not cross the threshold of the sacristy in the church or I went out as a child of God. Amen. So what's changed? I am still the same donkey as I could not walk out there in, in 2005. I'm the same guy. I didn't go on any courses. It wouldn't take me anyway if I showed them the school report. <laughs> I went into a, a prison in Hungary and I never felt as much at home in my entire life. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like you're not the only one that shut me down. <laughs> the donkey is still there. But I don't hear him, <clears throat> nor I don't see him. Because I'm the very, very same person that was not able to walk across. I'm still the very same guy who my wife said to me she wanted a car. I didn't take any course that changed anything about me on the one page Bible. Because this went in and it cut out every negative thought that I or anybody else had about me. That's all it took. One page. But what's in it is the mm. Word of God. And they're the two places that's going to beg him. A child of God or a slave to fear. I'm no longer 